little sneak peek into the new apartment. Um, I'm actually inserting this footage at the start of this video from future me. So it's gonna get a little bit confusing, but I really wanted to jump in at the start of this video and show you guys these beautiful bags that I recently got. They are from a Gold Coast based brand called Kin and the bags are just literally the perfect everyday staple bag. They are black with gold hardware. I'll show you guys. Um, but the reason I wanted to tuck this in at the beginning is because I don't want you to miss out on the discount code that I have. I actually do have a code for 20% off the bags and it is the perfect time to get your hands on them. Heading into Christmas, heading into the new year, um, obviously with the new year approaching, it's just like great to have your shit sorted and I feel like having your staple everyday bag is one of those things that just makes you feel so put together. I know me when I just have like my go-to bag that I always grab, it goes with every single outfit. It just makes me feel, it's like matching underwear, it just makes you feel nice and complete. So I'm going to show you guys sort of how I'd style them, what I would wear them with. There is three. I'll just show you guys and stop talking about it. These are them here and they are so stunning. This one, let's just start with my favorite. This one is my absolute favorite. I just love the shape of it. I think it's really timeless. Um, they are black like I mentioned and then they have the gold hardware and I just think they are so stunning. So this one I love because it has this huge statement buckle and it is just so gorgeous. It actually does just pop open really easily as well and then in here this is well, probably like my favorite feature the fact it actually has a zip here as well so it's nice and enclosed i might just like wait until i'm showing you guys the outfits to sort of open that up because i can't do it one-handed um then we have this really cute little backpack this is perfect for traveling if you're traveling yourself um i don't know over the holidays or into the new year such a cute little travel bag um or if any of your friends or family are such a great present idea super nice and spacious in there as well and then we also have this one which i feel like is just like the perfect everyday bag like i think this is everyday um but it also can be dressier as well and it's just like a little bit smaller whereas this one is really nice and deep so you can fit a lot in there and it's just a perfect everyday bag. And it's just really simple and chic as well. So I'm gonna show you guys what I would sort of like wear with these. First up, we have my favorite bag, of course. I've just paired it with some black boots, cute little matching set, some sunglasses for vibes, think afternoon drinks with your girlfriends, margarita in hand. I feel like this is definitely the vibes with this bag so cute so like i mentioned before this one is my personal favorite i just think it is so stunning i love the shape of it i feel like it's really timeless really chic and not only is it a great everyday bag it is also a great going out bag i just love the gold hardware so stunning like is this not such a vibe this outfit so cute um but i'll show you guys what it looks like with like a more casual outfit as well but I think like a little bit dressier for this one. I really like this. Then for a more casual fit, we just have black top jeans. This is definitely something I would go out in all the time. And it's just so cute. I think that all of these bags would also look amazing. I'm not gonna wear it, but this is like my go-to outfit at the moment is a black t-shirt, black leggings, new balance, and then like a black bag with gold hardware. It's just my vibe at the moment. So, the reason I'm going to show you guys that is because we just sleeped up the hair and I'm going to ruin my bun if, if I put on a tight t-shirt. So, we're not going to do that. I need to get dressed and then do my sleep bun for that. But, just envision it. So cute. I'll show you guys the, like, the bigger bag with this as well. So, this one, honestly, such a good size. You can fit so much in here. I think there's so much room. Oh, I need to show you guys the inside of the other one. I'll show you guys the inside of this one first. So I'll show you guys the inside of this one because I just forgot to. But it just opens up and then it has the zipper there. And then there's so much room in there. And there's also like a little compartment on one side and then the little zipper area on the other. So honestly, what more could you possibly want? I also feel like the shape of these bags, you can fit quite a lot in there because it has like the different ends. I don't know if that makes sense, but... This one is a really big one. So obviously has the clasp there. Wow, I'm so close to the camera, sorry. And then you just have heaps of room in there. It has another little section and then it also has the zipped up section as well, but it's really nice and deep. So if you are one of those people, not actually like me, I was gonna say like me, but I'm actually really good now at minimizing the amount of stuff I take out with me. But if you are not good at that and you need lots of room, then I feel like this bag is perfect for you. So yeah, 
that's all of them. Oh, obviously there's the, um, I'll show you the little backpack real quickly as well. I feel like this one would be super cute for if you have any travel plans or anything like that. It has a little compartment at the front with the zip so you can put any of your cards or license ID, whatever in there. Um, we also have the section in here, perfect for cameras and whatnot, any essentials. And then you also have the adjustable straps at the back as well. So that one is super, super cute. Um, like I mentioned before, I do have a 20% off code. So if you guys Guys use Ali at 20 at the checkout you can save 20% off and I really wanted to include this at the start of the video for you guys because I want you to be able to make the most of it heading into Christmas I think it's a really great present idea I'm going to try and get this video uploaded ASAP for you guys so that you have enough time to order it as a Prezi whether it's for someone else or for yourself um, and I will link it down below for you guys as well but here is the rest of the video I'm just heading up to the shops I want to show you guys my outfit, I'm actually so obsessed with this top. I showed you guys in my white fox haul, but it's like this like gray tank top. And I don't know, I just feel like it's so flattering. Then I just have these jeans, these are also white fox. My code is AliXO for white fox. But yeah, I just gotta go to the shops. I need to get Steph's, um, Steph is who I got for Secret Santa. So I need to get her Secret Santa gift. The limit is only $100 though, which like does stress me out a little bit because I feel like like just handing over one thing like feels weird to me. I don't know why, like I like to give a few things. So, um, or like a lot of the stuff I have in mind is like $150 or $200, but I feel like I always go a little bit extra and no one else does. So I'm like, I don't want to go too overboard. So, um, there is like a lip oil. I think it's like $60 and then also the Dior backstage blush is like 69 and I think they come in like a really cute like bag like Dior Bag if you buy something at the moment, I'm not entirely sure I'm gonna go suss it out But I feel like that would look really cute together like a really cute little like lip oil and blush, but I don't know if it's Steph's like a blush girl <laughs> So I don't know if all else fails. I'll just like get a bunch of stuff from Mecca like minis or something I was gonna get her like a replica candle or something, but sorry. I just realized I'm like talking to you Sorry, I just realized I was just talking to you for so long in the mirror. I may as well flip you guys around I was going to get her a like replica candle or something that was an idea I had But then it's like is it weird just giving her like a candle like just one candle? I don't know so I'm gonna go and see and I'll show you guys what I end up getting anyway. And I also want to get some wrapping paper for the presents that are going under our tree. I think I'm going to get like gold. I think we're going to do gold this year. And then like maybe red ribbon or something. Just make it like really festive. Usually I always keep it like super neutral and just like white and silver. But I feel like some gold and red thrown in there could be really cute. I feel like my new red silk <laughs> Christmas pajamas have really inspired me with the red. So... We'll see. I just came into Maya. It's actually so cute in here, all of the festive stuff. And they actually have what I was after in stock. They just restocked the um, Dior Backstage Blush and the lip oil. So we're good for Secret Santa. I'm just in Target. I honestly love it here so much. This is like a really bad example. Not much happening in the background here, but they honestly have the best homewares. It has me shook all the time, which is so much better than it used to be. But I just got some Christmas cards. It's like a brown, super cute. And then I also just got some gold bonbons and I think they're adorable. I also got gold wrapping paper and stuff from H&M. So it's all gonna match and it's all so cute. I also need some more bowls, but like it looks white, but for some reason it looks kind of gray. And the ones we have are white. And this one is a cereal bowl, but I don't know if I need a cereal bowl because we're only like we're missing one. I think one smashed. I don't know if we need a cereal bowl or a pasta bowl. Like I don't know what it is that we have at home, so I need to check and see what it is that we have at home so I can get the one that's missing. Um, but yeah, I know they also had like a bunch of Christmas stuff, but I think they've like sold out of it. It was like, um, like these sort of glasses, the flute glasses with the gold trim like this, but now they only have these ones left. So I think I'm just gonna leave with this for now. Back from the shops, 
my bag's about to fall over. <laughs> there it goes. I just got, um, yeah, I already showed you guys these. I got these bonbons from Target. Also got these Christmas cards, just nice and subtle. And then I also got the gold boxes from H&M. I think I've showed you guys in a previous vlog, but they're really cute. It's like a gold like box. I don't know how to explain it. I'll show you guys when I set some up on my Instagram anyway, like when I've got stuff to put in them. Also got some red ribbon, super cute. I got this candle. It literally smells like Christmas. Oh, it smells like heavenly. It smells so good. Um, gold wrapping paper. And then I got these for Steph's present. They didn't end up having like the um, Dior wrapping or the little bag, which is really annoying, but like they're still cute, so. That is fine. Jake and I are going to head to the shops. We're going to get some cookies for dessert tonight. I really want to get the, um, it's like the Bennett Street Dairy cookies. It's their new red velvet flavor and they are so good. I'm so excited um, to get some. I'm literally wearing my silk pajamas to the shops. I have absolutely zero shame at Christmas time. It's happening. These are also just so comfortable, you guys. I'm obsessed with them. Just wearing them with my Oe bag. And then my Uggs. We're in the shops, you guys, and I was stressing out about my pajamas. But as I was like freaking out to Jake, as we were walking in, I was like, I need to go home and get changed. This um, has been so dramatic. But anyway, this old man was so cute. What did he say? He was like. He was like. I love your outfit. Yeah, he's like, I love that. You're out. <laughs> yeah, like just as I was saying, I wanted to go home. It was perfect. It's so just was what you needed, hey? Yeah, just the universe just talking to me, you know? You know? But we found the goods. We found the cookie dough. Honestly, this whole section is just really talking to me. This is it. We've had this one before and it was really good, but we're getting this one. Oh, it's with white chocolate as well. Red velvet and white chocolate cookie dough. Yum. Okay, we're gonna get two of these and we're also gonna get some, oh my god, because my teeth wants me to make us some. And then um, some ice cream as well. Beautiful. Also, how cute is Jake's fit, guys? <laughs> oh, I missed it. <laughs> yeah, go. It's <laughs> so cute. Any slides? Dirty socks. Comfy. Your socks dirty. We got the goods. We also got some ice cream to make cookie dough sandwiches. Got the chalk fudge brownie from Ben and Jerry's. Guys, I totally forgot to vlog, but our cookies are in the oven. They're looking very red velvety. I'm very excited. I'm leaving this out to melt because I feel like it's just so much better for the cookie dough sandwiches when it's like a bit melted. Oh, I'm gonna show you guys. I can do this one handed. It's not really working for me. Oh. Where's that? Fuck. Why is this so hard? Okay. Okay. Got yeah. it. Yep. Look at that. Delicious. Hello guys. It is the next day. Um... Let's talk about the hair for a moment. I really don't know how I feel about it. I washed it this morning because I was honestly so overdue for a wash. I've been just putting it in a sleep one every single day. And I was like, you know what? I need to put some effort in, but I still don't have my extensions in. So I was like, what am I going to do? So we somehow got here. I think I kind of like it. Like it's kind of cute. Obviously it doesn't help that I'm wearing a tartan print right now because they literally look like I'm straight out of the Grinch. But I feel like once I've got my outfit on, It'll all come together. Sorry, I didn't even tell you guys why I'm all dressed up. We have our girls friend mess this afternoon and I'm so excited to see the girls. We're going to Rickshaws. We literally booked it so far in advance because it books out like crazy at Christmas time. Very excited for a bug roll, always. I also recently tried the, um, cause Natisse is allergic to seafood. So she gets the beef roll and she made me try it and it was so delicious. It's like a beef brisket and it is like so good so I sort of like want one of those as well because it's actually really really good um but yeah I've got my I've got a few options I'm really undecided so I wish this could be like live so I could just like ask you guys in real time for your opinion but we'll work it out I've got to wrap 
Steph's present as well. So I think I'll do that really quickly. And then some of the girls are coming over to mine before we go. So we'll all go together. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. Okay, we've had a dilemma. I started wrapping oh, I started wrapping the present, but then I realized they're just not gonna look that cute because they'll be so small and I really want to do like red ribbon. So I think I'm gonna use one of these boxes. I literally just called Talia to ask her. I was like, do you think my secret Santa will be mad if I ask for the box back? And she was like, no. So I'm gonna ask for this box back just because like they're a bit expensive, okay? So I'm gonna use this instead. I'm just gonna put them in here and then do the ribbon because the wrapping paper just wasn't going to quite work and this will just look so much cuter maybe i should maybe i should still wrap these up but put them in the box i feel like that'll be cute i'm gonna do that little chocolates should i do ribbon no i'll just do ribbon around the should i put the card in the box card in the box i think i should I'm gonna wrap so it's like a cute little bundle you know but in i don't know why i'm like i don't know why but i'm really nervous like i feel like i'm like really shaky and i i don't know why Secret Santa stresses me out a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna put her in the box. And then our ribbon. Got how you like sort of do this to be honest. Okay, so I think you go over, under. It's like over, under. And then like that, I think. And then that way. Yes. That's it. And then back this way. And then I'm just not sure if that's enough. I feel like I need a little bit extra. Okay, so back over. If anyone has any tips to this, please let me know. Like, if there's, like, a certain measurement you should use. I mean, like, measurement, but, like, I don't know. If there's, like, a hack to, like, the size of the box. I don't know. It's probably a quick TikTok away, but we do not have time for that. All right. I think that'll be good. Should I risk it and cut it? Surely it's fine. Let's give it a little bit extra just in case. cute does this look i feel like it looks like an even better present just because it's wrapped nicely like there could be a piece of toilet paper in there and some would still get excited about it because of the packaging i'm obsessed these are so cute outfits wise i have a few options i actually was going to wear this um like this baby boo dress it is so stunning I think I'll try it on still. Like, I know it looks really good on, but I just don't know about this with my hair. Um, so that was my number one option. But then this, Are oh, You My Dress, came. And it's, like, really cute. It has, like, a really nice open back. I just steamed it. So I'm going to try both of these on and see which one suits better. I hope you guys can see me okay there. But this is the baby boo dress. And it's so pretty. I feel like it's definitely, like, a really beachy vibe um and it's actually really overcast today i was hoping it was going to be sunny it was so sunny yesterday but unfortunately not today 
and I just don't know about it with my hair like this. Like I feel like a sleek bun or like hair down in waves would be better. But it is so cute. That's the back. I also need a moisturize, so just don't judge that situation. So that's option number one. And then we'll try on the other dress now. And then we have option two, but now I don't know about either of them. I think I need to change my hair because I feel like I'm just not vibing either of them. So it's like this mini dress has a really cute open back as well. Um, and then this I can actually tape down with some like ruby tape, but now I don't know about like I don't know about either of them now. I'm a bit I'm a bit stressed. <laughs> okay, we have decided on an outfit. I'm gonna go with the RUMI dress just because it's like very like extra and I feel like I'm not gonna have like many opportunities <laughs> to sort of wear it and Jake said he really liked it so he backed me up and we're going with this it's actually so adorable so let's just hope that i can hold myself in the whole time like at least we're going to be sitting down so i feel like it's sort of fine i just need to make it into the table sit down and then i can relax the girls will be here that's them speak of the devil hello hello come on up Yay! So they're coming up now. Did I dress that okay? Yeah, we're good. So we're actually Secret Santa. Emily has just arrived for her Secret Santa. Santa. I'm actually so shattered. Yeah, it's so it's, it's very unfortunate. But it's alright, the floor was there. It's still, but it's still coming. It's, just not it's still coming. She's still it's getting so her present. She's coming today. Too. So it came an hour after I arrived at Alice. It's notified me. I'm like, so I'll show you guys after what I got anyway. I just wanted to say, I love you guys so much. This is my favorite. Just want to be amazed. This is my favorite time of year with the best people in the world. I'm so grateful to see you guys and let's just have a beautiful lunch together. Our really amazing end to 2022 and let's bring on 2023. like pitter pattering around the kitchen we ended up having a really chill night last night we just watched the holiday it was so good um i literally love that movie so much and then what are we doing this morning we are going to go to the booty class at never quit and then we're gonna go for a big morning walk go get breakfast and i'll bring you guys along for it So the world is our oyster at this point. We're gonna go get a coffee, go for a morning walk at Burley. Um, Hopefully tan at some point today. We're not turning, Emily. <laughs> like, have you it's seen? It's set at 11, so it's got four hours to clean up its act. I'm gonna show you guys the weather. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm the whole the sky is gray. <laughs> it couldn't be any more gray. It said on like, my feet, sunny, sunny emoji and cloud emoji from 11. And and some very the wishful UV thinking. index is very high instead oh, of at that point. Okay. So wishful thinking, well, but I'm manifesting yeah. it's clear. But it might. Hours, yeah, it's totally it might be fine. Even like the other day, it was like, I woke up and I was like, what is this weather? It was so miserable. And then it was like the most beautiful day ever. I don't think it's going to be like that. But as long um, as it's sun, like a bit of sun yeah. and no wind, I'm We're happy. We could but like I literally live pool. in the windiest building. Are you serious? I will not be going by that pool. It's a bloody winter. <laughs> it is crazy. No, it's not. It was so good when we were It was good, yeah. Time. And it was. We, I was getting sand all over me. I ended up going up Dude, to the pool. The be if I don't have to go to the beach, win. I love the beach. How are you not a beach person? No, I love it. Hurts my soul. Anyway, we're gonna go to breakfast eat. after. <laughs>
makeup on. We just got back from our morning walk and breakfast and it was so good. I ended up getting the burger and it was actually delicious. I'm like obsessed with smashed beef patties. I have been for like probably like a year now and it's just this thing. I just crave them and it was actually really good. I got a bit nervous because it needs to be like really crispy, the patty, but it was good. And it was basically lunchtime by the time we ended up having breakfast because um, we actually did some Europe 2023 planning because Charles and I are planning on going over and then Verity and Emma are also planning on going over so we were just trying to like plan which bits we'll be meeting up for and that was actually really productive so that's really exciting but I'm going to sign off this vlog now because we're going to go to the shops and just have a look around and a browse and I've got heaps of work to do tonight when I get back so thank you guys so much for watching I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video